What is going on guys? And here from Fishing 203 and today I have for you guys the Maxell Ocean Max line of reels. Now these reels from what I've heard are amazing. So I'm just gonna crack this box open, show you guys what comes inside and uh, then I'm gonna go a little bit more in detail about the reel. So check it out. So immediately inside the box you get uh, your schematics like normal with most reels and you get two tools, your Torx wrench and your actual wrench, which for me, as you guys know, is a big plus. So a lot of foam in the box. And then your Maxell reel comes with a case on the outside of it to protect it from scratching. Check that thing out, huh? All right, let me pull you guys in for a close-up. All right, guys, so out of the box, this reel is incredibly smooth, actually. It's not as smooth as an Accurate or a Trinidad or something like that because it doesn't have any bearings in the handle. It uses uh, what I'm assuming are two stainless steel washers, but that will actually help you in the long run because that's one less bearing that will, uh, that will go due to corrosion. The handle comes off similar to an Accurate where it threads backwards, but the threading is actually on the tube here instead of the outside rim. And it just uses a simple flat head screw to come out. Tighten up. And now, for once in one of my reviews, I'm actually going to be smart and put a piece of tape with a line on it. So I'll give you guys an accurate reading with a free spool. So I'll do that right now. I'm going to start the timer first, then spin it. So you're going to subtract a second or a half a second. or it, it doesn't really matter. All right. I'm gonna call it stop right there. So 50, I'm gonna say 54 and a half seconds. 55 seconds, something like it, whatever. It, it's close enough. It's very close to a minute, which is actually very, very impressive out of a, uh, an out of the box reel. So Maxell doesn't actually tell you what bearings are in here. They just say stainless steel bearings. So those stainless steel bearings actually fare up pretty well with a speed test because almost one minute out of a free spool, out of a reel you take right out of the box is actually up there, high grade. So impressed with that. So basically this Ocean Max 05 here is a, is a size five. It's the smallest size that they make out of the Ocean Max line. And it kind of just stacks up with like the with like the accurate Boss Valiant 300. It's around that same exact size, but uh, just the plates are a little bigger on the side. Here, I'll show it to you. Plates are a little bigger on the side because accurate has that conical side shape on it. Uh, ball handles, Ocean Max is a little bigger, relatively the same size, but the accurate has the has the bearing in it. And the drag is actually almost identical. These Ocean Maxes have a twin drag system in them. So this is not a single drag like an Avid SX. This has dual drag. So it has two drag plates on each side that press evenly against the, the spool to create even pressure when it's going out. So it's a very smooth reel. It has 23 pounds of drag at the strike position right here. And then when you crank that knob down, it can get up to 33 on the full position, which is actually more than I've tested with the Valiant. So more drag than the Valiant, and it has a bait clicker for this size. And the bait clicker on these, actually, I like a lot because they're super, super loud and really, really easy to push. I'll demonstrate that right now. 
Look at this. With my pinky, just barely pushing. So these, these are super, super easy to get in and out of the bait clicker modes. The gear ratio on this reel in particular is a 4.5 to 1, which is kind of like that happy medium. You know, the, the two speed accurates normally go 6 or 6.1 six, to 3. So 4.5 is exactly dead center of that. So it's kind of like that happy medium between a super high speed and a super low speed. So you can literally use this for everything. You can use this for down south, for grouper, uh, you can use it for tuna, yellowtail, uh, up here where I am in Long Island Sound, you can use this from stripers, bluefish, you can use this for flukin, uh, black fishing. It, these reels are so versatile, you can literally use them for everything. Uh, this reel holds 440 yards of 30 pound test. That is a shit ton of line, you guys. That's a lot of line. And the reason why you're kind of getting the bang for your buck with these is uh, they're made overseas. So they're still made, engineered in America, in the United States. But uh, the labor cost is so low, you're getting a reel that in the U.S. would be around six, $700. But you're only paying $385 for this model in particular. Now the weight on this reel is around average for a reel this size. It's 18.75 ounces. So it's obviously not as light as the Valiant, which is just scraped every little bit of uh, material out of this thing to make it as light as possible. But this is just a tank. I've read reviews on this reel. I've, I've talked to people who've owned this reel. My father owns this reel. Uh, it, it's just, you can't, you can't kill him. My father's had this reel for a year and a half now. He's never cleaned the thing once. All he does is he comes back from fishing, he wipes it down with a wet rag, and he, he's never even had to take it apart and lube it yet. And it's still just completely smooth, like exactly the way he bought it. So 4.5 to 1 gear ratio, that'll be around 27.7 inches every single time you take one full crank of this handle. So that'll be perfect for everything you got to do inshore and even for jigging. So the body of this reel is a one-piece frame. So from right here over to this slit is all machined out of one block of aluminum. So it's very strong, it's solid aluminum. And the gears in this reel are heat-treated stainless steel gears. So they're, they're very strong, very similar to an Accurate. This has carbon fiber drag systems on each side, dual drag. Like most Maxells, the knob on this is in-swept. So it keeps your hand closer to the reel, which gives you a lot more control and power, which I like a lot. I like reels that you can, you can just keep tucked into your chest and reel nice and accurately. So another amazing thing about these reels is it comes with a five-year limited warranty. Uh, not a lot of reels that you'll find out on the market will have a more than one or two years of a warranty on it. So definitely check that out. And uh, if anything fails on this reel, you can send it back to them and they'll fix it. And then finally, let's take a look at this beautiful anodizing on the outside of this reel. There's really, out of the box, not a whole lot of flaws on this at all. It's like 95% perfect. Mine has one little tiny nick right there. I don't know if you guys be able to see that, but it's like almost unnoticeable. It's a little black nick in the anodization, but heavy duty anodization, that'll help with corrosion resistance. And it'll keep this reel tugging along for many of seasons. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys stay tuned. If you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. And if you like the video, hit that thumbs up. I'll be out on Long Island Sound fishing before you guys know it. We're going to start out with black fishing first, do a couple videos for you guys, and then come out with some fluke and stuff. So make sure you guys stay tuned.